Welcome back for another video. I'm Ahabad, a free-to-play and game player in Raid Shadow Legends. So I've made a bit of a last-minute decision that I am actually going to go after Razzlevog Fusion. I actually really want a copy of the Epic as well because I don't currently have a viable decrease attack champion for Clan Boss. I think I could make it work using the larger. It would be better if this restorative froth was on a 3 turn cooldown as well, because I want to run a 2 to 1 comp in Ultra Nightmare. The decrease attack on a 3 turn cooldown. If this was on a 3 turn cooldown as well, it would be, definitely be more, more useful. Um, but poison on A1, decrease attack, and a bit of extra sustain for the team is a decent overall kit. The issue is the amount of uh, shards required is quite prohibitively high. I only have seven sacreds right now. So by my calcs, I'd need to use seven sacreds and 11 voids to get here versus just using four sacreds and another uh, 40 mysteries to get the Margrave Greenhawk. So it's quite a considerable difference in shard cost. Um, and then obviously we'd also have the champion chase to consider, uh, which I think I could do without any any sacreds but uh i'd say for the initially let's summon four sacreds see if we pull something that would work as a decrease attack champion if we get lucky and uh then maybe we don't need to go for the epic so fingers crossed uh a vrask very good for faction wars but not solving that that issue <laughs> so let's see what the next sacred brings uh husk also a very good champion excellent for hydra provoke on the a1 um but again doesn't doesn't solve the problem but two two very solid epics to start off with third epic here not a good one adriel not a good champion does have a decrease attack but it's not on a consistent basis i mean it does it's 100 of critical but it's a five turn cooldown like no <laughs> this is such a bad ability right okay the last one from the first four is Ulfrig, who can actually do decrease attack. It's a low chance. That's the problem. But I'd have to try and deal with it. I'd probably have to turn it off. Good champion, but don't think, think this chance is just too low to be viable. You do have 45% with Sniper. If it was just 50, if it was 10% higher, I think you'd be in a, in a good position. I don't know why they've made it so low. So I think we're going to have to go for it. It's going to wipe us out, to be honest. Getting here, like we're going to have no shards. It's going to take 11 voids to do it. Um, I was kind of hoping that we'd hit one of the... Uh, one of the 10x's to be honest all the epics are very very strong not to mention the legendaries on the void side actually the the um the 10x champions aren't so great what are we gonna do i think we're just gonna have to commit we'll go all in hopefully we'll get lucky here Thenacil, a Fairly decent epic, but needs a rework. Cooldown's too long. Bringing it off. Stag Knight, that's a fantastic pull. I'm super happy with that. I could actually probably use Stag Knight as the decrease uh, attack, decrease defense champion in the in the Ultra Nightmare Clan boss team. Um as an alternative to to getting this uh this poisoner. But let's um let's plow on. We're kind of committed at this point, I think. Uh, Mistress of Hymns, still a trash champion. I already have a copy of her, so she is a dupe. Let's do the single first and then the temple. Rare dagger, not the worst, but not that great. It's hoping for at least one epic that's good. That would be, that'd be kind of the hope. Towering Titan is not that epic. One other epic that's good. Painkeeper, maybe. Someone, something. Paragons. Useful in some instances. 
I'm not a big fan of Paragon Cheese. And as I mentioned, Towering Titan just just isn't good enough um, overall, to be honest. Uh, but anyway, that is that. The Summon Rush should be done by five additional points. Uh, and we got an XP barrel along the way, some energy. So not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. Collect that and that. Cool. Okay. Well, that's it for this bit. Uh, I'll probably add it into the part of a larger video. If I don't, then that's all for this video. A very short one. Um, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye for now.